what we're looking at here is only one coin, but it's a coin with a tremendous history. What you have here is a object that was made by the United States Mint in very early time frame, but it has a fantastic story. The story basically is that a gentleman by the name of James Ross Snowden, whose book you're seeing here, was a collector of Washington medals, but he was also director of the United States Mint. And because he was director of the United States Mint, he tried to collect things with Washington on it, and he did not have a half cent with Washington on it. So a gentleman in New York by the name of Edward Bishop made him a half cent. You see, there's a half cent, you can see the reverse of up there that says half cent, showing you the one side. What he did is he took a regular half cent been made by the Mint in 1793, and he took off the side that had the picture of liberty on it and put on a bust of Washington. He attached it, a piece of metal. And he gave it to Snowden. Now Snowden, as the director of the Mint, decided that it needed to be in the coin cabinet of the United States Mint. So he gave it to them. The book here shows you not only uh, Snowden's book that he made on the medals of Washington, but in the, in the smaller element, the smallest coin in those pictures depicted is in fact the original metal. Now, once the Mint had this particular piece, uh, in their, uh, he, put, he had it put in their collection, but it had not been made by the Mint. It had been artificial. At that time, the Mint was trying to build up its coin cabinet, uh, a collection of coins that it had struck. Problem was that <clears throat> there was no money allotted by Congress to do this. So what they did is they traded some th coins they had to collectors for earlier material that they no longer had. Now, for example, if they wanted a 1794 dollar and they didn't have one, they might take a medal that they'd made of Andrew Jackson or something and trade it to the collector for this. In this particular case, another collector wanted a copy of Washington Half Cent. Well, the men had never made any to start with, but it had this artificially made piece that had been donated to it by Snowden. So it made a copy of that and gave it to the collector. It was called an electrotype, where they made the copy of it. Okay, and this is the electrotype they made from that particular uh, coin. So the electrotype, which was not stamped like a regular coin, was actually made by the mint uh, and given to another collector. It's, you can trace it to an 1859 auction when it was sold. Okay, and this is a story about how that came about and why this item is rather unique. If you like this video, we're sure you'll love these three videos above, and please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Coin Week is the number one source online for all things numismatic. Visit www.coinweek.com to take your hobby to the next level.